Well, Josh, actually, just a few minutes ago, they actually shot the, shut down both lanes of Route 101 eastbound here in Raymond as they've finally gotten this uh, box truck up onto the highway where they're going to be loading it onto a flatbed and then they're going to be taking it out of here. This tractor trailer flipped over about uh, 7 o'clock this morning. Inside the box truck were four large natural gas tanks that authorities say fortunately were virtually empty. Authorities say they don't know why the truck flipped and the trailer left the road, but it was the only vehicle involved and the driver was not hurt. Traffic was down to one lane most of the morning and was stopped for about five minutes while officials began to vent what little gas was still on the truck. Fire officials say this is a new way of transporting natural gas, and it's the first time this type of truck has rolled over in the country. State police say they were lucky things weren't worse. Uh, we are being told that there is very, very low risk. Uh, the, the natural gas on board, there's three cylinders inside that trailer, and essentially they were empty. Uh, there's a little bit of, of fuel left on board, which is, which is natural. Uh, the tanks have remained pressurized. They're, they have not been compromised in any way, shape, or form, uh, and we do not believe there's any risk to uh, any of the immediate area here. Taking a look now, this is that box truck that has been loaded onto a flatbed tractor trailer, and they are now taking it out of here. We believe that it's going to be going to Exeter. As we said, that there were four tanks on there. They usually have about 4,000 pounds each of natural gas in each one of those tanks, but today they only had about 500 uh, pounds total in that vehicle. So they all they did was they vented that gas, which uh, went out into the atmosphere, uh, and the situation was deemed safe. We understand also from Raymond Fire Chief Kevin Pratt, he believes that this crash and what they did here to make the situation safe is going to be used uh, as a training mechanism for other fire departments here and around the country. Pointing live in Raymond, I'm Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.